Hi, this is Zidane Tutorials and in this video we are going to learn how to make multiple selections uh, in Adobe Illustrator based on color or shape of the objects. This selection technique is often overlooked by a lot of new designers although it's very helpful in complicated uh, artboards where there are hundreds of layers overlapping each other. So what we normally do is that we just select some shape and if you want more we hold the shift key and click on the next one and then on the next one another way of selecting multiple objects we normally use is that we draw a box and all the shapes that come inside that box get selected so yeah uh, in cases like these where it's easy we uh, we are obviously going to use this same method but what if there is a complicated scenario uh, although I'm not using one just for the sake of keeping everything simple and easy to understand I will keep it uh, I will use this uh, artboard with all these multiple shapes and colors so the technique which we are going to learn or what uh, about which I was talking about is that we will select one shape and then we will go to the top where it says select simil similar object this icon which is often overlooked by us so you just need to click on this one and all the shapes in black color will get selected so it was pretty easy as compared to holding the shift key and, and selecting all these shapes one by one and in this case it was easy but just imagine or assume a complicated uh, design where uh, uh, the black colored icons or shapes are scattered in the whole document. So we can use this technique to, uh, to select all the shapes in black color. But what if we are not targeting the color and we want to target the shape instead? Uh, in other words, I, I don't want all the black shapes, I want all the circles uh, in uh, and they could be in any color. So in that, uh, in that case, I will select the circle or the shape I want to target. Uh, target and then I will go to this drop down and you will notice by default it has selected all but instead of all you need to select shape and here it should be clear to you if you will select appearance it will target color and if you will uh, select shape it will target shape so now if I will click on shape you will notice it has selected all the circles uh, in whatever color they were it will just select the shape it will target the shape not the color this time so these were the two methods uh, where either you can target color some particular color in your document or some particular shape in your document in the same way uh, let's reduce the opacity of these two I will change the opacity to 50% okay so now if I will select this black one and I go here and this time instead of shape I click on opacity it will select these two because these two are the only ones in the entire document which have same opacity and if I click on let's say uh, this square and I click on this one again it will select everything except these two because these two have different opacity and rest of the shapes have 100% opacity so that's uh, how easy and simple it is and it has so many options in it you just need to select one shape and then you need to go to this drop down and here you will find all the available options or the filters which you can use to target some particular kind of shapes whether based on color or opacity or stroke weight or fill color or even the shape so that's all for this tutorial i hope this video was helpful to you in uh, understanding how to make multiple selections in Adobe Illustrator. Uh, thank you so much. Have a nice day.